Yo, what is up guys and welcome back to the Marcos Movies channel, a place to learn more, know more, and talk more about movies. On this channel I rate, review, and react to movies, so if you enjoyed today's video, please consider clicking that subscribe button and turn the notification button so you never miss another upload of mine. So as today's video is titled on thumbnail states, I'm going to be watching season 1 episode 2 of Hannibal. I am so excited to watch the second episode guys, after watching the first one, I mean... I was this close to just watching like five straight episodes back to back to back, but I decided, you know what? I'm gonna let the first episode sink in. I rewatched the first episode, and I gotta say, this feels like Silence of the Lambs mixed with The Shining. Put into a TV show, crumpled up, a little bit comes out, a little bit comes out of each movie, but they combine to make one great thing, and I'm so excited. And the I would say the biggest takeaway as well from the first episode was obviously Mads Mikkelsen as Hannibal. I'm so excited to see where the relationship between Hannibal and our main character goes, our main protagonist. I, I can't wait to see that. A couple people have told me that the basically the whole show is about the relationship. Thanks for the spoilers. It's all right. It's not a big spoiler. I kind of expected that. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get right into this and go ahead and quit the talking and get to the reacting and let's start watching Hannibal. This game is practicing. Dude, he's such a badass though. I really like this main character. <laughs> See, here's the question. Was this of Hannibal's doing? Hannibal Lecter, or is this a new guy? Well, what we learn about Garrett Jacob Hobbs will help us catch the next one like him. There's still seven bodies unaccounted for. She ain't doing good, guys. But as I was saying, I was really interested to find out if Hannibal was going to be, like, the killer throughout the whole show, tricking other people, or if Hannibal, like, I don't know. Never mind. Never mind. I'm sorry, guys. I heard you said someone else is here. You can also tell though that he's like haunted that the fact that he had to kill him too though You could tell he doesn't it's not just because he couldn't Darren really Jacob save Hobbs her It's because he didn't the want to kill The question now her. is how to stop those his story is going to inspire Okay to active return to the field Question is do you want to go back to the field? I know he's gonna but he should Back in the field It's not your choice Jack let Will damn decide he's a grown ass man Are we starting now? Oh, the session wouldn't be with me. Hannibal Lecter's a better fit. Yes! Let's go. Oh my god, the man, the myth, the legend. I love how he dresses, too. What's that? Always wearing a suit. Your psychological evaluation. Jack Crawford may lay his weary head to rest knowing he didn't break you, and our conversation can proceed unobstructed by paperwork. What you need is a way out of dark places when Jack sends you there. Last time he sent me into a dark place, I brought something back. Is this therapy or a, a support group? <laughs> I was going to say that. It's whatever you need it to be. Or mushrooms. Like they got tubes to water them or something. No, it's a marijuana plant. Okay. There is the burial ground. Dude, the makeup work and the prosthetics they do on these dead people is amazing, too. Two straight episodes with it. Kid, okay, we got nine bodies, various stages of decay, and as you can see, all very well fertilized. Yeah, you think? She buried them in a high-nutrient compost. So is every new episode going to be a new case? Or is there going to be... Oh, oh no, 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 That's not the right person. That's probably the person who did this. I'm one of the parents of the explorers who found the bodies. Can you uh, tell me what that man is doing over there by himself? He's some kind of special consultant. Works for the FBI. He's alive, but he will never.
never be conscious again. So they're all in comas. Oh one of them's alive? And it's the one with his mouth. This may have been oh premature. my god, no, no, I don't like how did he No, I don't Out in the field. Okay, just calm, just calm. Hobbs. He feels guilt he really feels guilty for that man. Why did he leave them exposed? To hold their hands? She's being too sketchy. Miss Kimball? Yeah. And she's a patient of his. Great. I've uh, never seen a psychiatrist okay, before. Okay, so she's not. Okay, we're and good. I well, am we're not unfortunately good. thorough. So, you're one of three doctors I'm interviewing. Here, I was wondering... Are you Freddie Lawrence? <sighs> That's... This is unethical, even for a tabloid journalist. He knows already. I am... Uh... I'm so embarrassed. Hannibal's too smart for that shit, honey. You were very persistent about your appointment time. How did you know when Will Graham would be here? What kind? Pork. Wonderful. I don't sure? get many opportunities to uh, eat home-cooked meals. My wife and I both work. See, once again, is that a human or is that actually, like, normal food? It adds to the suspicion. You think Will Graham's a broken pony? I think you think. Will is a broken pony. You ever lost a pony, Jack? Mm -hmm. I've already had my psyche valve. Not by me. I love the not just alcoholics aspect. who have compromised endocrine systems. They all died of kidney failure. He buries them, feeds them sugar to keep them alive long enough for the circulatory systems to soak it up. So he can feed the mushrooms. We dug up his mushroom garden. It's like, I don't know what's my favorite part about this show yet. The detective aspects, Hannibal Lecter, the sequences when he's dreaming. Like, what's the best? Picking up a prescription for Gretchen Speck. Gretchen Speck. Horowitz. Oh, it's just Speck. We're divorced. I lost the hyphen, kept the ring. Oh, could you sign here, please? And he had his own side of the frickin' refrigerator. Or cabinet. And that's your correct address? No, this is very bad. This is very bad, Will. Games. If you could sign here, please. Everyone, please stop what you are doing. His car! Give me your baton. She's alive! Now. You are naughty, Miss Lance. He killed her. And he ate them all. Oh. All clear? <laughs> you got all that information from a local detective? Nope. Lots of talk about your man, Graham. Not to mention the rivalry of who gets the collar. I'd appreciate it if you didn't. You don't write another word about Will Graham, and I won't have to. She kind of looks like a redhead version of Samara Weaving to me. You used me. Yes, she did. Just not in the way you hoped. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to. That's better times. The old lady said that, in her opinion, Europe was entirely to blame for the way I think they're going to have a relationship she later. Said, You're reading. Seems like she's just his friend. I think they'll get in a relationship. Did Jack send you? No, I sent me. Yeah, right. Back to uh, Jack Crawford's crime gimp. It certainly creates an image. Don't feel sorry for yourself because you saved this girl's life. I don't feel sorry. I don't feel sorry for myself at all. So does he feel bad because he feels good about it? I feel like there's a lot of confusion in his mind, friends. I don't know where you got half that information. It wasn't from me. You may have made some inferences. Right now, future you is thanking me. I read your article. Did anyone just see that? Jeez. Graham was right. Stamets is looking for connections. What did you tell him? I need to know what you told Eldon Stamets about Will Graham. He's gonna bury her. 
No, no, get him out. Get him out of there. No, you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I thought this was gonna be like a whole three part thing, but I think he's gone right now. His dream, go where the bull went. No, your dream, remember your dream. Shoot! Yes! This guy's a good shot! If you walk through a field of mycelium, they know you are there. They know you are there. It's spores. When you shot Eldon Stamets, who was it that you saw? I didn't uh, see Hobbs. Then it's not Hobbs' ghost that's haunting you, is it? If your intention was to kill him, it's because you understand why he did the things he did. It's beautiful in its own way. Giving voice to the unmentionable. It's almost like killing must feel good to God too. It's almost like he feels a little psychotic too. He felt powerful. <laughs> how many how many one-liners is this man gonna have? Jeez. You know, when I was talking to my Patreons about the show, and I was telling them how it felt that every episode, or at least the first one, felt like a movie. They were like, yeah, every episode is going to feel like that. I was like, nah, it's probably going to... I think this first episode is probably like, going to be the best of the season, at least. I like this episode more. I felt I got so many more of my questions asked while still feeling a sense of confusion. Which is great because this is a show and I'm going to learn. And I'm so excited to learn more. And I can't wait to see Hannibal and Will's relationship grow. Oh my god, it's it's just... Uh, I, I'm trying to pick a favorite part of the episode, but I can't. I want to say it's Hannibal, but I think it's Will's confusion and confliction in his mind of... Is he almost as psychotic as the killers for feeling good about killing them and bringing them to what he thinks justice is? Great lines, great dialogue, great screenplay, great effects. And I'm, I'm just going to stop saying that because I'm just going to expect that from the show. And until an episode doesn't bring me that, then we'll talk about that. But guys, another great episode of Hannibal Down. Only the second episode. Can't wait to get into the third one. Make sure you drop this video a thumbs up if you're excited for the third episode. And if you guys would like to watch my full-length reaction of Hannibal and watch the whole series with me, you could do so with the first link of the description, which will take you to my Patreon page. But as always, guys, keep watching movies.